Welcome back to Couch Collectibles. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. Today we are looking at 1978 pennies that are worth money. We'll look at different types of mint errors and different conditions for these coins and of course different coin prices. So let's just hop right into it. Don't forget to go check out all the other coin videos here on the channel. If you guys have missed any, let's just hop right into it. All right, so 1978 D mint mark here. Now this coin here has a very high grade of a mint state 67 red. Now because of that high grade, that is what gives the coin all of its value. Now if you have this in a mint state 66, it's not going to be worth as much. 65, 64, not going to be worth nearly as much. Uh, 67, 68, 69, 70, of course 70 is a perfect grade. Uh, is going to be what is going to be, uh, you know, worth a decent amount. Now this penny here sold for over $480 because of its high grade. This next coin here is also graded by PCGS at a mint state 62 red in this case, and it has a mint error. It's got a 40% brockage here on the obverse of the coin. So pretty noticeable type of error. Of course, you don't need a coin microscope for anything like this. This penny here sold for around $125. Moving on to a 1978 D that has been double struck with the second strike being 65% off center. Of course, you can look for off centers, different types of off centers on all kinds of different coins, not just Lincoln cents. In this case, it was struck 65% off center and this penny sold for over $130 as a result of that mint error. Now, of course, in 1978, the D mint mark, they produced over 4.2 billion of these coins. So they're not valuable in terms of how many they actually made, but stuff like this can give them a little bit of value. Now, this is a 1978 no mint mark that has the obverse struck through a capped die. Of course, you can look for capped die coins, uh, not just on pennies, on quarters, all that stuff, dimes, nickels. So this coin here sold for around $65 as a result of that error. Now, same thing with the 1978 no mint mark. We have a mint state 67 plus red grade here. So that is where all the values coming in at. And that plus helps it out, that red grade. This coin sold for over $4,000. Four grand, can't beat that man. Now here is a coin that sold on eBay. Uh, it hasn't been graded. It's just an off center coin. It sold for around 10 bucks. So, you know, not really worth having uh, graded in my opinion. Uh, but here is another off center that is graded, 1978. 30% uh, off center here in this case. And this penny sold for around $50. So again, I personally wouldn't have it graded in that condition. Now here is a 1978, again, struck 15% off center. And this coin sold for around $80. And then we got another 1978 off center that was struck 45% off center. This coin sold for over $100. All right, we're, uh, I think we're done with the off centers. Here's a 1978 uh, double denomination. So we have a penny Lincoln cent design struck on a 10 cent coin. So we got a Lincoln cent design overstruck here on a Roosevelt dime. Very, very cool. This coin here sold for over $700. I absolutely love double denominations. And again, for the no mint mark, they produced over 5.5 billion of those coins. So not rare in terms of how many they make. Now this is the proof coin. So it's the S mint mark, 1978, graded by PCGS at an absolute perfect grade, a proof 70. You cannot get any higher than 70. And it also has that deep cameo. This coin sold for over four thousand dollars four grand all right guys don't forget to subscribe in the middle check out the videos to the left of me and until tomorrow i will see you on the comment section below this is couch collectibles and this is where i disappear